So we're backstage here at Holly Fulton. It's a very 40s inspired, elegant, powerful woman. So where the rest of the head, I've kind of gelled it and given it this like 40s inspired thing. It kind of really helps. And then you get this low ponytail, which makes it feel young and fresh. It's a side part. And then you get a really nice detail, which is very elegant and sophisticated in the back. We're doing blue on the outer corner, white on the inner, and then a bit of a fade between the two in the middle. So you've got this nice, these fresh colours fading together as a bit of an ombre. And then everything else is super clean, lovely fresh skin with mineralised moisture foundation, just a lip balm lip. And that's pretty much it, just, just fresh and clean and healthy with this one minimal statement eyeline. I like a printed coat, so I'll be looking forward to look number one. <laughs> it's got a coat with my name on it. We were thinking a lot about folk art, so we started with quite kind of naive initial references and looking at traditional kind of British crafts. I was very inspired by a painter from Scotland, my home country, called J.D. Ferguson. And his wife ran a sort of a 1930s dance troupe, if you like, and it was all very decadent and sort of sinuous yet feminine. She was a very strong woman, and that sort of fed into the, the kind of confidence and power that I wanted the collection to have this season. It's a bit of a return to a use of bold colour for us and always a strong graphic, but I wanted it to maybe be a bit more sophisticated and a bit more chic in its kind of interpretation. So it's for a confident modern woman. We played a lot with the interplay of embellishment and prints. So we've done prints with that are embellished on top, so you get quite a 3D surface, but it reads almost as flat, so you can see it till it's side on. We've worked a lot to expand on a technique which was probably the most labour intensive thing we've ever done where we use handmade organza ribbons woven into our pattern. They almost may look printed from a distance but they're all handcrafted from scratch and they were very, very intensive pieces to work on and my, my personal favourites in the collection, they were a real labour of love for us as a team. I think a lot of the silhouettes are they're quite easy to wear, so I wanted a sort of sense of easy luxury and modernity within it. That's sort of what I'm drawn to sort of wearing at the moment, so I'm sure I'll be working a few of those pieces myself. I would like a ribbon weave shirt, but I probably can't afford it. <laughs> It's very different for us, I think, this season. Um, we've gone for a much bigger silhouette than ever before. Um, and dresses aren't as, they're sort of a looser fit and sort of wider sleeves are sort of one of the big differences. We have a few longer length pieces, but generally everything's kind of midi length, if you like, which for me, that's what I want to be in at the moment. <laughs> Selfishly, so I've decided to use it in the collection. <laughs> we've been showing for five years now, so this is our, slightly our anniversary, really, actually. Good. We're at a very confident point with the business and there's been a lot of changes this year but in a hugely positive way. So we've had quite a few changes to the team, we've grown a bit, we've got a new space. It's been a lot of things have, have yeah, moved on I guess and it feels really fresh and exciting point for us as a label and I'm, yeah, I'm really excited to see what people think of the new collection. I think it is different for us and I hope people react to it well.